Dutch from two different sources. Uh, 3D06, which is a feeder from Lumpville, and the 2N14, which is a Hartford feeder. The main feeder for the University of Hartford is the 2N14, and we are normal when we are in the 2N14. The 2N14 power supply from Hartford feeds into a power station on campus, which through the underground wires feeds all of the academic side of campus, the complexes, commons, and Hawk Hall. The 3D06 from Bloomfield feeds all other residential side buildings. It was maybe a cost analysis that was done to decide whether it would be easier just to put these buildings on the Bloomfield feeder because they're right here. So you wouldn't have to run a duct bank all the way from East Hall all the way to the village of Harmony. Yeah. The problem that the university has run into is that when the Hartford power supply goes out, main campus buildings can switch over to the Bloomfield power supply or the campus generator. Unfortunately, when the Bloomfield power supply goes out, Regents, Park River, and the village are unable to switch over to the Hartford power supply or the campus generator, leaving those students in the dark. The 3 bo 6 we've had some problem in the past, but it has stabilized over the, over the past few years. Um, two years ago, it was problematic, but uh, we've stabilized. That, that power has somewhat stabilized since, since then. And this the 2 and 14 feed typically uses 4.2 megawatts of power and the generator can support up to five megawatts of use. So with the past 3 bo 6 problem and the inability to access that generator, many wonder if the school has plans for Regents Park River and the village. Executive uh, director, we have met and we are looking at, at um, what we could do. We don't know which building, we don't know how expensive, but we are doing a study to see exactly what can be done uh, in, the, in the future to, 